start off by saying looking sharp, but we're trying, we're trying, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, 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 we're trying, we're trying that here, you yeah. know. That's no, good. What are you most looking forward to tonight? To be honest, it's just uh, I'm looking forward to just meeting my colleagues, my my good friends. These are the guys that literally um, made me who I am today, man. Garage music was the foundation mm -hmm. for UK, you know, with the music, and it was the, the the starting point for me in my career, you know. So I'm looking forward to seeing my my friends come together in one space to celebrate. It's a massive reunion, isn't it? Yeah, it's a massive reunion, boy. It's just like. It's like homecoming, you know? <laughs> uh, I totally get it, man. I totally get it. So the class of, what was it? 2000? The 2000? Yeah, this yeah, 25, yeah, that, what, 98 or something like that? It's crazy. Crazy. Yeah, um, the, yeah go on. Yeah, no, no, that's crazy. Um, 25 years plus uh, UK Garage. It's changed so much over the years. What do you anticipate coming up for the, the, the music scene? Well, listen, you know, um, it, everything kind of goes around in, in cycles, you know. When the garage came out, you know, we found a lot of independent um, artists able to, like, put, record music in their bedroom, have the whole underground system on lock. You know, we had our pirate stations and we had our own distribution. So we were able to write songs in the bedroom. By five o'clock, we'll have it getting played on the pirate radio stations. Mm -hmm. We were able to go and do the gigs at night. Mm -hmm. All the nightclubs were playing like garage music on the main room. So we had our own ecosystem. We didn't need the major labels, you know. We were very much independent. And this was that without the internet. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And so I feel like we're kind of getting there. Obviously, with the internet is here now, we find a lot of independent artists. But to be honest, I don't think we'll ever get to what we had. Right, right. With, with, with do you think that? Do you think that's because the bar was set so high, or, or um, what, what, why do you think that is? I think you know, you know, with the, in, with Garage, we had so so many talented people, and it was all about the music. You know, with Garage music, you know, you went out and it was the beats, it was the melodies, it was the great song, the hooks, and stuff like that, and, and we had lots of really great songwriters that were able to express themselves with that genre of music you know it was soulful it was funk it was you know it was groovy it was raga it was everything yeah, you know? yeah. and so um you know that 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 time is so nostalgic for me right now that time i don't think we're ever going to be able to repeat that mm -hmm. or replicate that you know it's a shame but it's still a beautiful thing because it it holds its own you know and and, and the fact they can never i don't believe unless something happens but i know yeah. um I, I feel like it's, 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 a, it's a sacred time and we should always be cherished and i'm so glad that i was a part of it yeah totally understand that mate so what about yourself uh, coming up in the future what we got coming up in the new year for yourself um loads of things man you know so i'm getting my denzel on now i'm getting my uh, my idris elba going that's what we like to hear bro yeah yeah so you know just finished doing the getting it on tonight as well yeah we're trying that here baby yeah so yeah so you know my acting is going good you know so i've just finished doing a disney film right now um, and then um, I've got an academy just um, supporting up and coming artists. So I've got an, uh, an, an artist development academy, which I'm just coaching artists into the industry with performance and stuff like that. Um, I'm just doing a lot of things, yeah. but it's definitely in, in always entwined with the music, you know. And so very, yeah. So very much foot on the pedal still, yeah. Always, yeah. always. It never stops. It's in yeah. the blood. That's so what we like to hear. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Christmas just around the corner. Yeah. How are we feeling about that? We're looking forward to it. You know the thing with Christmas, you know, I think when you pass a certain age, you know, you, you realise Christmas is only about kids and, and women. I think that's, <laughs> that's the only, that's yeah. the only people, uh, we have to pay for it. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right, I mean. <laughs> so, you know, it's expensive, you know, I've got to tell expensive you, time of year. it's an expensive time of year, but let me tell you something. When it comes to Christmas uh, trees, I'm the king of Christmas trees. No one should mess with me when it comes to Christmas trees. I need to hit you up then, yeah? Listen, I am the Don Dada of Christmas trees, but I go in with my Christmas trees, right, bro. No, Artistic. Good. Yeah? No, wicked, man. Picasso based. Picasso, baby. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time, man. I hope you have a great night, yeah? Thank you. Lovely. Thank you, man. Thank you, man.